Hello, hello, and happy Friday, my friends. I am Christine with Christine Chalks a Lot, and we have an exciting project to share with you today. So let me turn on all my lights and light this place up. Oh my gosh. So I have to tell you guys, do you remember? Holy cow, that's so bright. Woo! Okay, so do you guys remember the other day I was telling you guys about my cute little guy? Okay. And he was, um, he died, right? Remember that? Do you remember my cute little guy? Um, that had a, like a little succulent in his head. <laughs> it died. So I have to show you and look what I did. Is he so cute? <laughs> I just love him. So I went, hello. Hi mom. Hi Rich. Hi. Um, so look at how cute this is. Is he just adorable? So I went um, to Hobby Lobby and I got this little succulent guy and hot glued it in there. So I don't ever have to worry about it dying on me. So, cause it's fake, <laughs> but isn't he so cute? So now I have him right there looking at me. <laughs> I just love him. All right, let's make sure I am live, which I see myself there. Isn't he adorable, mom? I know, oh my gosh. Okay, I have a cute project for you guys today. So I am hoping that it's gonna work. <laughs> so let's hope, right? All right, so I am using this stuff here. Um, this is, hold on, it's something. I think this might be our refill. However, I don't think it's gonna be available in the new catalog. It is not gonna be available. So this is the pennant refill. So it's not gonna be available in the new catalog, so I think it's already gone. However, um, it's like a canvas, so you can use whatever you wanna use. Um, if you wanna use any type of fabric, go for it. I'm gonna give this a whirl. I've never tried this before. Um, we're gonna try it today <laughs> and see if it works. We're gonna make cute little buddies, and then after that, we're gonna make cute little carrots. So guys, we are all about the spring right now. So we're gonna try this. We're gonna try our hardest, but first we have to figure out what we're doing because this is inside out, right? So let's go ahead. Oh, it's two of them, guys. I got two of them. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is, we gotta do, should I just maybe cut it? You can tell I am not a sewer, guys. I am 100% not a sewer, okay? So we're gonna go like this, and my thought process would be that if we do this, and this is how we want it to be, I'm gonna go ahead and ink it, and then it's gonna, I'm gonna hot glue it together. So that would be right, right? Okay, so let's, we're just gonna ink the one side. Aren't these adorable? Look at, aren't those too cute? So this is the Bunny Duo. Bunny Duo is what this transfer is. And as a reminder, don't forget guys, our new, our new catalog comes out Tuesday morning. Tuesday morning guys. Um, this, I wrote my name on mine so nobody steals it. This is the new catalog. Comes out Tuesday, all kinds of fun goodies in here. I did put the link in my VIP group. So if you guys are not part of my VIP group, make sure to get in my VIP group, Christine Chalks a Lot VIP. So get in there, check things out. If there's anything you want me to order right away for you Tuesday morning, I will do that. Just send me a message. Um, they do have a cute Easter one in here um, that I seen. Look at the lemons. Oh my God, I'm seriously gonna have to have those. Um, where are they? So somewhere, oh, there it is. Isn't that so cute? Okay, so there's the bunnies in the new catalog. Can you guys see that? Is that adorable or what? Okay, so I am so excited about that. All kinds of fun new colors, all kinds of stuff. And if you guys join my chalk club, okay, so it's a subscription DIY chalk membership, okay? So it is amazing. You get this transfer this month. Okay, this is the transfer for this month if you sign up. Isn't this adorable? So it says, take the long way home, find joy in the journey. Let me tell you, 
you sign up for this. My goal is to get five more club members, okay? You sign up for this in the month of February, you get $75 worth of free retired transfers from the past club couture transfers. Did that come out right? I hope that came out right. <laughs> so it's $75 worth, guys. That's a lot. You get five free transfers that are from 2021 that nobody else can get a hold of unless you're a designer like me or a club member. So I'm super excited. So you can get that. Um, and what's really cool is you get a catalog. So that was what I wanted to share with you too. So you get this awesomeness, you get three paste singles that come with this, plus you get the five free transfers from um, a selection of, they get to pick it, of 2021 club transfers, and you get the awesome catalog. So I'm telling you, that is a steal. That's what I'm saying. Okay, so let me know if you guys have any questions about that, because that is pretty cool. All right, so I think we're going to do these bunnies. Now, these bunnies look adorable look confusing too but they sure look adorable okay there's see how they're like uh you have one and you have two right we're not going to do that today because we don't need to because we're going to do these little stuffies a stuffy bunny okay so we're just going to use this one and then we're going to use this one i'm hoping this is going to work so if you guys have ever done something like this feel free to chime in if I'm doing something wrong because I've never done it before but this is one of those projects okay that when it's in your head it seems like it should work <laughs> right it seems like it should work okay so I'm going to just cut that off I don't I don't I just don't know why that's doing that so I don't need that right okay well, thanks for joining me, Mom. Mom and Rich, I appreciate you guys joining me on this Friday. Okay, so here's this. We are going to ink this. So I'm still going to use ink on the canvas. Technically, I can do paste or ink. And you might ask me, well, why, Christine? Why would you do paste on here? Well, the reason we would be able to do it is because I'm never going to wash this. Okay, so I'm never going to wash it. So I really don't care. Um, if it's permanent or not, okay? Now, mind you, chalk, paste on here, like say if I didn't have the color, right? So if I didn't have this color and I'm using papaya, okay? Let's say if I didn't have any type of an orange at all, okay? Which I'm not even sure if I wanna do an orange. What color do you think we should do the bunny? I don't know if I wanna do an orange, orangish color bunny. Um, so if I wanted to do a paste, okay, which we may end up switching to a paste if I don't have the right color in an ink, we can still do a paste. It would still go on here. It doesn't come off because it's a one-time use, so it'll stay on here. However, um, it just wouldn't heat set, okay? Do you just love watching me? Am I entertaining you? <laughs> so you tell me, this is the color I was thinking, but then I was like, this isn't really too Eastery, right? So... Do you guys think I should do a different color? Um, let me show you. So one thing I like about ink compared to a paste, because I can always do a paste, okay? We can do whatever color you want. Um, the ink goes on smoother. So because it's a little bit um, thinner, so it's a thinner base than the paste is. Paste is a little bit thicker. So this will go on smoother onto a canvas, but it's up to you guys. I mean, we kind of want a spring color. So let me show you what I got. Let me show you what I got in my inks. Oh, I have a tie. Can you guys hear me? Ah. Guys, I am so excited. I am so excited, seriously, about... Um, being able to do a spring color right now. <laughs> okay, here's what we got, ready? We have couture coral, so we can do the couture coral. Yes, an Easter, I think that says Easter, color. How about a yellow or a pink or something? Okay, so I do have, I have couture teal, so I have that one too, maybe those two colors, we can do each one, because don't forget I'm gonna do this little baby one too, okay? So I'm gonna show you. So here's this one we're gonna do, and then we're gonna do this one, okay? And then I have sage, 
So that's a green one. And then we have berry, which is the purple one. We have tide, which is kind of like a, a dark teal. Okay, let me see if I have any uh, yellowish. I don't think I do though. No, I don't. Okay, so those are my Eastery type of colors if we do ink. And again, I'd really like to do ink. So I'd like to, to stay with ink. So what do you think? I think these colors are pretty together. I think those two colors are pretty together. Let's get rid of Tide because I think it's going to look weird on, on this surface. So let's get rid of Tide. Teal for sure. Okay, so let's do teal. And then do you, which color do you think looks good with the teal? So, oh my gosh, it could be literally any color. Okay, so let me tell you. We're going to put it with, okay, I'm going to get rid of this. We're going to put this with orange carrots. Okay, so let's put that together too. Go, Okay, guys, we're going to put it with orange we're going to put it with this orange. I'm going to do um, shimmer pumpkin. I'm going to do shimmer pumpkin as my carrot. Okay, so let's make sure that if, if we're going to put it all together, what looks nice, right? So if I did those three colors, I don't like that. That looks nice. Come on. With the yellow. Teal and yellow. Okay, so let's do this. We're going to try it, guys. So we'll go ahead and do yellow. Let's do, we're gonna, we're gonna test it. Okay, so here's this, ready? We are gonna test it. So we're gonna do one ink, one paste, have a day. Look at us go. All right, so how do you think that looks? So we'll do a teal and a bumblebee yellow. That'll look really, really nice. I'm excited about that. And then we'll do the shimmer pumpkin as our carrots when we do our carrots, okay? So let's do it. Let's do it. All right, so here is our teal. And with, remember with ink, we technically don't have to, um, with our ink, we don't have to mix it, okay? So I'm gonna mix our paste. But we haven't used our paste in a while. We haven't used this yellow in a while. Ooh, dang. Guys, I'm to so excited about this. And I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry that I was not here on Wednesday. I know you guys missed me on Wednesday, um, but I had a really bad migraine on Wednesday. I don't even, came out of nowhere. I was just done. So I don't know if you guys get like that. That all of a sudden you're just like, Ugh. and the thought of having to try to craft and do all that, I just couldn't have it. I just could not have it. Okay, so actually guys, you know what I'm gonna do? I don't normally do this lately. I'm going to actually write on the back of this one. Um, I'm going to write large bunny. Okay. So for you newbies that are watching or watch me on replay, because I, I don't think you guys are here now, but when you guys watch me, um, it's, I'm going to put large bunny. And the reason you do that is it's really important. And I haven't shared this in a while. It's really important when you go to put your transfer on here after you're done washing it. Because remember, these are reusable about 12 times. You want to put it on the sticky side of the backer sheet, okay? Really, really important because these are super sticky, okay? So you can write back on it. You can write what it is. You can do whatever you want so you remember um, that that's the back of it so you don't accidentally mess up, okay? And as a reminder, this is a screen print, right? So um, I can't poke my finger through here like you do on a stencil, okay? So very different. So if you guys are used to stencils, okay, if you guys are used to stencils, a stencil is um, something you could either purchase or make on your own using a machine. And that's a one-time use, right? So that's just a one-time use. These you can use over and over and over again. So when you go to make something like I'm about to, you can make, especially this, okay? There's a lot of transfers that we have that you're like, okay, why would I do that? Um, why would I need to buy a saying that says yay for today, okay? <laughs> that I happen to have right here. Yay for today and I'm gonna put it on something and then that's it. However, okay, these ones are very different because one, you can make a bunch of bunny, bunny stuffies like I'm about to do, put that all over the place. You can make a few different collages in your house. You can make them for gifts. You can make them for teachers. You can make them for family members, all kinds of things, right? 
So it's a little bit different than some of our sayings. And that's where it comes in handy, me having my workshops, right? Because then you can come over and do that yay for today and <laughs> not have to worry about purchasing that stencil or transfer, I should say. So see how that works? All right, so I'm gonna write, again, If I, I already took that off, but here's that shiny side, right? So on this one, I'm gonna put little bunny, okay? And we'll put that to the side. So now we're good. I'm nervous, so I'm gonna have to take a drink, okay? I'm not drinking wine today. I am drinking an energy drink. So I missed wine Wednesday. It was quite depressing actually. Okay, I'm very nervous. Okay, so we're gonna do the little one. The little bunny is gonna be yellow. I wonder if I should have made him up higher. I think I'm gonna guys, because why do I need the green? Why waste some of my stuff, right? So I'm gonna make him a little higher. I hope this is gonna work. Okay, let's make him yellow. I'm very nervous. Okay. Where's everybody at today? Everybody must be out and about on this Friday. Oh, this is gonna be so pretty, Mom. Good choice. Did Rich agree with you on the yellow? This is gonna be pretty. You just sometimes don't know because it's going on fabric. I wasn't sure how it was going to go on here. You know what I mean? Because it's a color. But actually, this cover's really nice. This is the first time I'm using our canvas, too, guys. I've never used our canvas before. So this is the first time I'm using it. And so it went on really nice. Okay, can you guys see me okay? All right, so now we're going to take this off. And I'm going to go a little slow because if there's anything that I want to... Oh, this is adorable. Anything I... Oh, registration mark. Thank gosh that's going to get cut off. That is just stinking cute. So I didn't notice that there's a little registration mark right there. And the registration mark is so if you wanted to do um, that other piece that I showed you, wherever that is, and you do it on top of each other, see how you do it on top of each other and you line it up. That's how it helps you line up. So it works out really well. So look at how stinking cute that is. Yeah, that's so cute. Okay, so let's go ahead and wash this. I have my water next to me. We're gonna wash it like normal. I think I tell you guys this all the time. So you wash it from the sticky side first. Take out all of the paste from the screen print and then flip it over and do the same thing on the front side. Yellow works really well because it's not staining it at all. So how great is that? And once it's all out, then you're going to put it on a towel or something next to you, okay? What's happening? Hmm, what's going on? What is going on? Do you guys still hear me? Okay, so if you guys hear me, Mom, if you hear me, just go ahead and say something. Because for some odd reason, on my computer screen in front of me, it's showing that I'm still talking about the paste and the ink. Don't know why. So, yes, you hear me. Isn't that quite interesting? <laughs> I don't understand that. So that's kind of interesting. Okay. So I'll just leave that. So we're going to do teal. Just please. I hear you fine. Okay, good. Okay. Um, so we're going to do the couture teal. It's so weird. So I'm, I'm going to have to pay attention to my phone then because I'm really behind on my computer. Isn't that so strange? I'm still mixing the yellow. <laughs> it's so weird. Okay. So we're going to do the ink. And as I said, the ink, very different. Okay. So the ink... Yeah, the ink is very different. It goes on much smoother. Interesting, isn't it? These have registration marks too. We can make even shirts out of this, guys. We can make a little shirt for Maddie that has little bunnies on it. Wouldn't that be so cute? We can make pillowcases. What else can we make? 
What else can we make with this? What other ideas you got? So I really kind of think I want to put this on a little heavier and it's again because it is the ink. I am just dumbfounded here. All right. And again, we got to make sure no lines, okay? You don't want lines in it because it'll end up showing through. So I'm going to go ahead and take this off. I'm going to take this off. Maybe. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and do this from the top to bottom, right? Look at how stinking cute that is. Although I see my lines a little bit. So hopefully those are going to go away. But look at how stinking cute. Hopefully the lines are going to go away when um, I dry it. So I must not have gotten rid of all my little lines. All right. So same thing. Same thing with ink. Okay. So you can use ink on our transfers. You can use the paste. You can even use etching cream. You can use torch paste. Guys, there is so much you can do with these transfers. And they hold up just fine. Just fine. So far, I've used everything on my... I don't think we've done an etching thing, have we, guys? Have we done an etching thing? I do not think we have. Okay, I'm just going to take a rag real fast and uh, just wipe the top of it just to make sure that we don't have any standing water on it, okay? So you don't want standing water sitting on your transfers. That's a no-no. Look at how stinking cute these are. Do you just love the colors too? I do too, mom, good job, good job. All right, let's dry these before I cut them. And you can use a blow dryer too, but it's really important to dry it. But just so you know, you can use a blow dryer or this quick dry tool. I have one of these in stock. So if you need one, I got it. Otherwise, um, a blow dryer, but just do not use an embossing gun. Okay, so you do not want to use an embossing one. It is Eastery, mom, oh my gosh. I'm so excited about it. I'm wondering if I should let this dry while I do my next project. I really want to make sure the ink is dry enough because I'm going to be messing with it. So I think I will. So I am going to put this to the side, okay, while we do our carrots. So I'm just going to put this over here and then we're going to do the carrots. You guys ready for this, okay? Guys, you don't even know what's about to happen. You don't even know. This is going to be crazy craziness okay let me just put my stuff away you don't want to leave your stuff out too long because it will dry up okay so you want to put your lids back on things so nothing happens do you guys remember these these are our trees that we had and we've done our trees but today we're gonna do them as carrots isn't that amazing ma are you amazed with this idea rich are you amazed with this idea look it it's gonna be a carrot so and i have two of them so these are our tree cutouts they are in stock and available the tree cutouts let me see if they're in the new catalog i don't have this new catalog memorized quite yet give me some time give me some time my friends they are not <gasps> look it they are not in the new catalog, guys. You know what that means. I need to get me some right away. So I have two. We are very amazed. <laughs> I'm glad you're very amazed, as I think I am too. <laughs> so I have two sets of these, this one, and I have two more sets in stock. So if you guys want to try this project on your own, let me know. You can either order them from my website or um, get them from me, whatever you want to do. But I do have some in stock. Okay. 
Now, some more, uh, some more participation from you, okay? Here we go. This is gonna be for one, for sure, okay? For sure I want this on one of my carrots. Now, my thought is, guys, is to do this on the other one or do two of the same carrot, or what do you think about putting this on the other one? Okay, I could just put this somewhere, wherever. What are you thinking? What do you think about that? I can put it like maybe like here where I could get some of all of this in our carrot. What do you think? Let me know what you think about that one, okay? So that's what I'm thinking for this one, okay? So, you let me know what you think, if you think that's a good idea. In the meantime, let's do this one, okay? This is called the Country Plaid, and this one is in stock as well. I am just on a roll with what is in stock. Yep, two different, perfect. So you were saying, yeah, like you like it, right, Mom? Okay. Now, country plaid, I'm telling you now, country plaid better be a, a thing come Tuesday. Oh man, how am I going to find it? We're going to go in this little index in the back here, guys. Okay. Isn't this amazing in our catalog? I absolutely love this part. So, in the very back, it goes by alphabetical order. So, country plaid is still available, guys. It's going to be available in the new catalog. Okay, so let's go ahead. Remember what we do. So we wax, right? So we are going to wax our surface. I wonder where Judy is and Lori. Where's my regulars? I wonder if they're out on the town, having a good old time. Out on the town. I'm so glad that you guys are here because otherwise I'd be all alone. All alone, talking to myself. Okay, so we're putting the wax on, right? And then we're gonna go to a different part and do wax off. You know what I did notice in the new catalog? They came out with a cloth, a waxing cloth. Isn't that cute? I think it's called a waxing cloth. I keep going to the new catalog. I'm so sorry. I keep going to the new catalog, but I just, I don't have it memorized yet. Um, but I think I seen it. I sure did. It's a new wax applicator. Look at how cute that is. Isn't that stinking adorable? I don't know how that's going to work, but it's a three inch microfiber cloth for waxing your surface. Scoop it out, apply the wax on one side, buff it with the other side. Hmm, isn't that cute? I don't know. It, it's cute, but I don't know. I don't know if it's going to be needed because it's awfully small. <laughs> Okay, so we waxed it. It's nice and waxed. Hi, Laura. I have not seen you in forever, Laura. Oh my gosh. It has been such a long time. Okay, guys, so we are gonna go ahead and do this. We do not have to wax. Yeah, we don't have to wax because we've used this transfer on this side before. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put it on here. Laura, we are making we are making carrots out of our Christmas trees. So isn't that fantastic? That is the way to use some stuff. Multi-use, right? I love it. So we're gonna use, oh, this is a little thick here. We're gonna use our shimmer pumpkin, mainly because I need to get rid of it, right? I hardly have any left and it needs to, needs to be used. We are gonna do it. Carrots, yes. I'm so excited. <laughs> Is that what you know? Did you see it in my description and go, what in the world? <laughs> so this is the way to use some of our stuff in a different way. So this is not gonna be available in the new catalog, so the trees are not in there. Although we are gonna have a cute little um, chalk made kit with carrots. So it's very cute. Very, very cute. So I'm very excited about that. And it's gonna be on fabric, so it's, it looks really neat. So 
You guys are gonna have to, you guys have to check it out. I don't know if you guys already seen it in my catalog, but it's gonna be adorable. All right, guys, let's hope this works. Again, works in my head, <laughs> doesn't always work here, right? Okay, let's see. Hopefully I got it all on there. All right, let's see. Ready? Here we go. Dun, da, da, da. Look at that. I absolutely love it. So there's that, okay? And then we're gonna put some moss and some little sticks up here. So there's that, and we'll, I'll wash this later. I wash these ones. Um, in my tub. It's just a little bit easier. So I'll wash that one a little later. I wonder if I could have painted this orange and did this in white. I wonder if that would have looked better. What do you guys think? Although I really think that's adorable. So I really, really think that's so, so cute. All right. So let's let that dry. What do you guys think for this next one? I'm going to do this. Do you guys think that I should do it should I paint this orange and do it in white? What do you think? Because I have two. What do you guys think I should do? One part of me kind of thinks, because this one is going to be so white, having them next to each other, having them next to each other, I'm kind of thinking to maybe do this one in orange and then do um, in white, do the transfer in white. What do you guys think? Yes, yeah, I think so too, mom. Okay, so let's go ahead. My only challenge is, I'm not gonna paint it with the shimmer because I don't think it goes through as good. Challenge is as I have a brand new orange and we know how, how challenged I am with taking this off. Dang it. Oh, wait, I am so, challenged when it comes to this. I just don't understand. <laughs> I hate this part. Uh. There's got to be an easier way. Although this was easier to do with the tweezers. Oh, that's good. All right. Okay, here we go. Brand spanking new. Eh. Okay, I'm gonna go through this way. So hold on a second. All right, I did not want to make a mess right off the bat. Okay, dokie. So brand new paste, we're gonna mix it until it gets to be that sour cream type feel, right? So we mix, mix, mix. Really, really important to do with our paste. Super, just use shimmer. I don't know if I wanna use shimmer though, mom, as a, as a base, because I don't know if we could, um, it's so thick, the shimmer is so thick. So I'm not sure how it would look as a base and then putting um, the normal stuff over it. Does that make sense? Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and do that. And then remember, so we're putting it, I just put it in the lid and I'm gonna use distilled water. So then if this, once the lid goes back on, if any of the water gets in there, it's not a big deal because it's distilled water, okay? So it's not that big of a deal. So let's go ahead, get our paintbrush. And then let's go do this. This is gonna be so cute. So, so cute. All right. Let's see, I'm gonna put a little bit more water in here. So what do you guys got going on this weekend? Anything exciting happening? There we go. All right. Look at how, this is gonna be so cute. It's gonna be so cute. All right, well, here we go. And I think I can probably get away with one coat. That's what I'm thinking. And you know what I think too? I think that Lori thought I was eight o'clock today. Cause I even told her that, oh my God, I'm so excited. I'm gonna do something new today. 
and I think she must have thought I was eight because I'm I'm eight o'clock on Monday and Wednesdays. But Friday is a little bit different because people think got things happening on Fridays. I'd even go earlier if I can if I knew people were going to be on. But quite honestly, <laughs> it's not it's not a lot. Once painted, will you need to put wax over it to put your transfer on? Yes. So yeah, we will wax then over this, which will be perfect. So I'm gonna use the dryer. So, and get this all nice and dry. And then yeah, we will definitely wax it because the wax is gonna create, oh, hi Lori, hello, hello. So the wax will create a barrier between the wood and the transfer. So then none of the paint will get on our transfer, because that's what we don't want it to get on our transfer. But you definitely want to have this nice and dry. Lori, you want to see? This is our carrot. This is one of our carrots. We're going to put some stuff up on top once it's once I'm done with this other one. Isn't that going to be so cute? Look at you grocery shopping. Oh my gosh. You know what's exciting about grocery shopping and the fact that I'm on Facebook is you can always watch me. Isn't that exciting? That's what I do. I watch a lot of people while I'm cleaning the house and <laughs> doing all kinds of stuff. Do you guys think I should paint the sides? Because look how messy that is already. I think I'm going to probably go back. Isn't it bitterly cold at your house? It is stupid cold here, Laura. Stupid, stupid cold. This is not dry because it went on a little thick right there. Is it not cold by you? Is it not cold? Not like we have a party tomorrow. <laughs> I know. We do have a bit of a party tomorrow. <laughs> it's so thick. I put it on really thick right there. Not talented enough to do both. Oh, it's probably because you don't have the... Um, you don't have um, AirPod thingies, do you? So that might be too, because I have AirPods, so I listen to all of it while I'm going. Okay, this is annoying right here. It's still a little bit, a little bit thicker than I like, but that's all right. All right, let's go ahead and put this on. So yeah, is it cold by you, Laura? Because it is super cold here. The weather everywhere is just a little bit messed up. Although, let me tell you, you know what I got from Joey the other day? He was sitting on the beach. <laughs> he was sitting, oh my gosh, it's 18 degrees. Good grief, good grief. That's absolutely ridiculous. Okay, so we're wiping on and wiping off, right? Um, yeah, 18 is ridiculous to me. However, Joey was laying on the beach. So he sent it to me on the beach, guys. Is that ridiculous? I was so, oh, I was like, are you kidding me? Okay, this one we're using is spring garden pattern. Guys, I don't know if it's in the new one. Let me check. <laughs> because otherwise, this is one we gotta get right away. Isn't it cute though? It's a cute pattern. All right, spring, spring, guys, it's not. It is not in the new catalog. Oh my gosh. That means if you don't get it, we gotta, you gotta come over to my house and use it. Isn't it so cute? Okay, this one's a giant one. So this is 18 by 18. This is huge. I know, Laura, Joey is just having so much fun. It's funny, he comes home for spring break, okay? So he's gonna come home for spring break and just for a couple days. And he said to Bill the other day, he's just like, oh my gosh. He's like, I'm gonna come home and I'm gonna look exactly the same because there's no sun here at all. <laughs> I saw I was cracking up. So he's like, I think I'm gonna have to go tanning. <laughs> At Planet Fitness. So I was laughing. Okay, I think I'm gonna use this part down here. Wait, where's my mom? 
It was really cold by Joey, like, day before yesterday. Yes! Oh, they had to cover all the... Yes, you're so right, Mom, because that's what he said, too. He said that it's been strangely cold there. And so that's why he's like, I'm not going to look any different. He has... Oh, gosh, guys, do you see this? Um, he's like, I have no tan. I have nothing. And so... So, yeah, I think it had to be yesterday then he sent it to me. Because he was, he was able to get to the beach, which he was super excited about. So, yeah. Isn't it weird? Am I still behind? I'm not really that behind, it doesn't look like. So, somehow or another, my computer is catching up. Is that weird or what? Okay. So, we're going to do the same thing. I am going to... This is going to be so stinking... So stinking cute. Okay, but I don't want that big flower. Oh my God, that's gonna be so cute right there. Yeah. You guys think we should do white? Okay, so, my friends. Okay, should we do is a big decision again okay so we can either do white shimmer harvest you guys seen what the orange looks like now shimmer harvest we can do an or a green or we can do a gold what do you guys think we should do on this what do you think should we do a white because this is how much you guys are seeing this right this is how much we're going to have here so that's how much is going to be seen so we can do either the bright white or we can do Shimmer Olive, so it's a green, Shimmer Gold, or Shimmer Harvest, which is kind of like a like a brownish kind of color. So what do you guys think we should do? What do you think? And while I'm waiting for you guys to tell me, don't forget, our new catalog comes out on Tuesday, 10 a.m. my time. So you think yellow, Mom? Yellow with the orange? What am I doing? I just put the yellow up to the yellow. Will you see yellow? Will you see the yellow? I don't know if you can see the yellow. This is a big decision, guys. All right, hold on. I'm going to do that. <laughs> okay, that's the yellow. So that's how the yellow, yeah. I would say, I don't know if we can see this one. So this is the yellow. I don't even know if you can see the gold. I mean, the harvest. I don't even think we can see the harvest, actually. Okay, you think white? I'm kind of going towards white too, Laura. I think I'm going towards white too. Because it'll pop a little bit. So I kind of think I'm going to white. All right, let's do it. And you know what? If we don't like it, guess what? We can always do the other side. <laughs> so yeah, let's do white. Because I, I kind of think, I just don't know what we are going to be able to see. So... You know what I mean? White, you would see best. Yeah, I think so too. I think we'd see the white best. So let's do the white and see. And then it matches our other one because our other one was white base with the orange on top, right? So now this would be the orange bottom with the white on top. So it'll be the same. All right, so we're going to push this down as best we can. Remember, there's a lot of screen here. So when you go to do it, you want to make sure that you're going from like the center out, okay? Just like that, because you have so much of the screen that there's gonna, like right here, for instance, is gonna be kind of like bubbles, okay? So, but if you go from here out, it's going to push it down as you go. So hopefully that made sense. So it's gonna do the same thing all the way around. This is gonna be stinking adorable. All right, and if you guys do anything like this, make sure you share in our in our VIP group, okay? I would love to see what you guys do. Would love to see what you guys make for Easter. 
especially even if you guys don't use our stuff, I still want to see it because I would love the challenge to see if I can make whatever you're making with our stuff. Does that make sense? So stuff that you guys make with whatever you got, just share it and then I'll see if I can do it. Oh, look at it, guys. Oh, it, it took it. Dang it, I was afraid of that. So it did take up, look at how stinking cute that is though. However, some of my paint, because it was not fully dry in the middle, which I was afraid of, um, came up. So it came right there. So that's what's yeah. So once it dries totally, all I'll do is take one of our little tools and touch it up right there with some of the um, orange paint, orange paste, I should say. Okay, so does that make sense? So let's go ahead and let this dry. We're gonna go back to our bunnies. Isn't this adorable? I am going to still put this away, but I'm gonna leave this one out so I don't forget which color I used because I have so many options over here. All right, guys, I have made, I've made such a mess. <laughs> such a mess. Oh my gosh. Such a mess. Okay. Now, the biggest challenge. I wish I had somebody that could just wash all of my squeegees for me. So now that, um, Lori, now that you're on and Laura, I don't know if you guys seen the video where I talked about my guy. Were you guys on when I talked about my cute, um, what is he? Little guy that I got at Home Depot. Um, I got to show you him. I showed already mom and Rich already, but look at him. Oh my God. Is he so cute? So remember I shared the other day that the um, succulent in there or whatever that I killed it. And so isn't he so adorable? And so I got this, it's just a fake one that I got at Hobby Lobby and I just glued him in there. <laughs> so now I don't have to worry about him dying on me. So I just love him. So now I have him sitting right there that I can look at him. Okay guys, we're on this. We're on to our bunnies. Okay. He's adorable, right Laura? Isn't he so cute? <laughs> and it is my color. So I shared it um, when I got him in the summer. And I actually, it was kind of funny because I had my nails the same color. So it was so cute. I think that's my Instagram picture, actually. I think it's my Instagram photo. So if I remember, where are my scissors? Oh, gosh. Hold on. Oh, here they are. Okay. So let's go ahead and cut this. I just love him too, Lori. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Guys, I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. And I probably don't have the best scissors, which doesn't make my life very easy. So, um, yeah. I wish I had better fabric scissors. Um, my friend, she does a lot of sewing too. I don't sew at all. And so she does a lot of sewing. And when she was in from California, she told me a pair of scissors to get. And I should have just bought them. And I have not bought them yet. And so I should have just bought them. All right, guys, here we go. I'm going to try my hardest to cut this <laughs> along here. And if I'm doing this wrong and somebody knows what I'm doing and I'm doing it wrong, please tell me because I've never done this before. I'm kind of excited about it. Okay. was dying on my phone I would have lost all you guys and I would have just been talking I would have just been talking to myself you guys would not have had a clue what was happening okay so I'm wondering if I should do this 
And then after I put him together, see, I missed it. After I put him together, should I cut it? You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm wondering. All right, so hold on. This is gonna be so cute. Once we're finally done with this, right? So just don't forget. Don't forget to sprinkle my video, guys, with your friends. Let's grow this crafting community, right? That's the plan. Look at how cute this is gonna be. I hope I'm cutting it's good. This one's gonna be cute because look how little he is. He's gonna be adorable. He is gonna be adorable. Okay. I'm a little nervous. I've never done such a thing before. And I can't sew, guys. So that is why I'm doing it this way. I cannot sew to save my life. I've really tried. So during COVID, the beginning of COVID, my mom's sister and I did a bunch of masks for the community. Thousands of masks, I swear. And let me tell you, they ran circles around me. So <laughs> I at least tried. I'm sweating. My glasses are fogging up. My glasses are fogging up, guys. <laughs> That's how much I'm sweating right now. So yeah. Okay, so look at how cute is it? Oh, he should be like that. Isn't he so cute? Okay, so I, I'm gonna do one. I'm gonna do one. And then we'll finish him all together. And then you guys let me know if I should do the other one too. Okay. I should have started with the bigger one. <laughs> should have started with the bigger one. That would have been easier, right? Okay. All right. So, logically, I have this. So, this is polyfill, guys. This should work. Should work, right? So we're gonna have this next to me. I'm gonna, I have my heat gun. Guys, I'm very nervous. Guys, it might be because my battery is low. Shoot. And it's not catching up. Okay, so look at how cute. He's not going to be able to go in all of the ears, though, guys, because the glue is too much. But that's okay. It does. It, I'm so sorry. It's probably because of the darn thing. Okay, I'm gonna put a little bit of glue here. I might have to cut this short then. That's a bummer, isn't it? It comes and goes for me, now it's back. Yeah, it's it, it, because my, um, because the, my battery's dying. Battery is totally dying. Okay, this is what's making sense to me, but again, never did this before, so. You know, I don't really know. I wish I had a skinnier glue gun. Just a little bit of glue. Just a little bit of glue on him. Isn't he gonna be cute? Okay, so just a little bit of glue. 
Rich, I think you should do this. I think, oh, you, darn it. Um, we should do a little craft day, Rich. If I can do this, you could do this. Although I don't know if I can do it yet because I haven't done it yet. And I'm definitely not gonna hold you guys to doing the other one. So I'll do the other one and then just post my picture. <laughs> How's that? Because you guys are gonna be here watching this for too long then. And it's gonna take up too much of your night. I am sweating. But look at how cute this is. He He's already looking cute. Look at him. I'm gonna be so proud of him. I'm gonna be so proud of him. I've never done something like this. This is so exciting. Oh, he's just gonna be stinking cute. Have you guys ever made something like that? He's laughing, he said no. <laughs> well, let me tell you, Rich. <laughs> If I knew it was going to be like this, I might not have done it either. Because <laughs> I'm really sweating. I'm a very nervous wreck here. That is not going to work. But he's so cute. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to put some more glue here. I hope it's going to work. I think he's so cute. It would help if I had little things. Because <laughs> he's pretty hot. Yeah, he's pretty hot, but isn't this going to be so cute? All right. I think they call these stuffies. That's what I think they call them. And if anybody made these before, let me know because there's got to maybe be an easier way. But there's more, there's, I'm able to put more of this in here than I really ever thought. Unless I'm stuffing it so much that I'm never going to get it to close. Should I put more? Look at all this I put in there. This is great. Oh my God. He is just so stinking cute. I'm going to put a little more. Oh my goodness gracious. Look at this. Oh, this is stinking great. Okay. And I think I'm going to keep it with the little outside like that. You know, like where I trimmed it. I like the way it looks like that. Okay, guys. Moment of truth. I'm closing them up. I'm doing surgery and closing them up. Oh, my God. Is he cute? Yep. He's pretty cute. Now I got it. Okay. So there's a little piece right there. So let's stuff that in there. Guys, this is so exciting. There's a little bit of glue oozing out, but that's okay. Did you use chalk or ink for the bunnies? So Laura, I did I did one of each so we can see what it looked like. So um, this one was chalk, okay? So I did chalk on this one. Oh my gosh, he is adorable. Look at him. He's all done. Look at how cute he is. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. So I did, this one here is chalk. And you, the reason I use chalk instead of ink on one of them is we are talking in the beginning. This one's ink, okay? So we are talking in the beginning that ink is the one that you would heat set and it's permanent, okay? Chalk paste can't be permanent. However, it won't wash off of this either, okay? Because it's, it's fabric and so it's not going to wash off of here either. However, if you're not going to ever wash it, then you don't really ever have to worry about anything happening to happening to it so um so I am mom I was gonna put Easter ribbon around his little neck okay however we're running out of time a little bit I have to close his his neck a little bit right here because I get still got to show the um trees okay so he's adorable he is stinking cute look at how much oh he's open over there too I, I I keep forgetting to close stuff guys I guess it's good to look around because <laughs> I forgot to close it right there too. <laughs> oh goodness. Oh goodness. That's funny. All right. So let's close in there. <laughs> That's so funny. This is going to be so cute. So anyways, yeah, I hope that you understood that, Laura. I hope that that made sense. Although I wanted to see, one, I don't have yellow and ink. So I have it over there. I didn't, I don't have a yellow. 
And so I wanted to see this one here, it, it went on fine. So it went on thicker um, because it is thick. So it went on, um, it went on pretty thick on this one. And then this one here is, it went on pretty thin. Okay, so it looks really nice though. So that's gonna be adorable, right? So there's gonna be the bunnies. Okay, so there's gonna be what it's gonna look like. That's what it's gonna look like. But let's go ahead and do one of the trees, the trees. Well, the trees in my carrot, right? So here's what my thoughts are. I'm gonna do a little bit of moss at the top. I just had so many things that I had to get. So we're gonna put a little bit of moss here, okay? At the top like that. And then I don't have the best um, little things, little twigs. I should have went out and got little twigs. I should have went out and got twigs, but I did not. Um, where are my other cutters? Where are my other cutter things? Hold on a minute, guys. I gotta find, I'm hoping I find my little cutters. Darn it. Where are they? I have other cutters that much easier to use darn it, than this, but okay. That's right. That's okay. So we're going to go ahead and put a bunch of hot glue on here. Here are my cutters. And then we're going to go ahead and put this moss all over the top like so. Isn't that so cute? So like that. And then, this stuff is very messy. We're gonna go ahead and just put some of this stuff on here because this is all I got. So you guys can do anything you want. If you guys have cute little spring twigs, I for some reason didn't have any spring twigs or they're somewhere and I just can't find them. Um, I gotta organize my, this is stupid. Um, I definitely have to organize my foliage that I have because <laughs> it is not organized. I have it all over the place and I think I should probably organize it based on like, um, like here's my Christmas stuff and here's my stuff for, you know, Halloween and fall and spring and all that type of stuff. Cause I had all kinds of stuff everywhere. So, and that did not make any sense. So here's what I was gonna do. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this like that and then put these ones attached to it. Does that make sense? Somewhere were my thingies, but I don't know where they went. Okay. Isn't this gonna be so cute? I keep burning myself. Mm. I keep burning myself. Okay. So there's that one. Oh my gosh, I keep. That's horrible, guys. That is just horrible. And if you guys have a better way to do this too, obviously, always share and let me know because obviously you guys know I'm pretty new at this. I'm pretty new at all of this embellishing. So, I'm pretty new at this. And some stuff that makes sense to me just does not work all the time. <laughs> Isn't this so cute? So I'm trying to hold, make sure it's going to stay in here good. Okay, I think that's all I'm going to do. Hopefully it. Guys, that hurts so bad. So don't do, don't do that. How about I just put the protectors on my fingers? I have them. Why don't I just use it? Dang, that hurt. Mm. Did you guys totally laugh at that? Because that hurt so bad. <laughs> 
it hurt a lot. I think this one's too top heavy. I think that one is too, too hot, top heavy over there. I'm gonna do it with this finger. <laughs> that hurts so bad. Oh my God, I tell you. Okay, look at how stinking cute that is. Okay, so obviously this one's fallen backwards because it's not dry totally yet, but that is what it's gonna look like. Isn't that so cute? So you guys, I can't wait to see what you guys come up with with this one. So again, I have, oh my gosh, I'm a mess. So I do have um, two of these in stock. So if you guys need them, I have them. If you want to make your own carrots, I would love it for you guys to make your own carrots and show me what they look like. I would love to see yours. I'm going to put a little bit more right here. Guys, this is so cute. But I really think I should do different um, trees up there. Little different sticks, don't you? I think that would look so cute. I got to find different sticks to, that will stick straight up. So something that can stick straight up in the air. Because these are not really sticking straight up in the air. I was hoping, because it's a little sturdy here. So I was hoping it was going to be able to stick up. But it's not. And I don't know if it's just because it's not dry yet. I guess it's sticking up. Isn't that so cute? What do you guys think? Do you think that's so cute? Does it look like a carrot? So what do you think? Does it look like a carrot? I think that's super cute. So let me know what you think of that. So I'm, I'll do this one over here a different time because I'm done. Um, I don't want to keep taking up your Friday night because it's already seven o'clock and I don't want to keep taking up your Friday night. So let me know what you think. If you guys like it, give me a thumbs up. Um, let me know if you guys would do something different. If you guys have other ideas, let me know because I always love to hear ideas from you guys. So let me know, let me know. And so um, other than that, I appreciate you guys watching and taking the time on a Friday night to watch me. And I will be back here next week. I am not going to be on Monday. Okay, so um, we have a college visit again on Monday in Indiana. So um, I won't be on Monday, but I'll try to share a video for you guys. So otherwise we have, that's what we have. This one, this one. And then we have our cute flipping bunnies. So isn't that going to be adorable? So this one, and then I'll finish these and then I'll, I'll put them on in my VIP page and on our business page. Okay. So if you guys have any questions, let me know. Otherwise, happy crafting. If you're going to craft this weekend, have a great weekend and I will talk to you. Show us when completely finished. I will for sure, mom. I will put it in my page and the VIP page. So um, yeah, I will for sure. But there, this one, it did turn out so cute, right? So it did turn out super cute. So as a reminder, my catalog comes out on Tuesday. If you guys want anything from there, please let me know because I'm going to place an order right away at 10 a.m. on Tuesday. And so I want to get stuff before it's sold out and they have some cute, cute, cute kits. So check out my VIP page. Okay. Otherwise I'll talk to you later guys. Thanks again. Bye.